Welcome back to part two of more of the DVDs that I have. I have so many, so we have to go to a second part. So, here we go. Now here's some of the ones that I have that are... Well, these are some that I just had to fit. I'm, I'm going to be getting a new DVD holder here pretty soon, but uh, I figure uh, we're going to show some of the ones that I have first here. But anyway, here's some of the ones I have in line here. Tommy Boy, Evolution, Kindergarten Cop, What Dreams May Come, Rookie of the Year, <clears throat> uh, 10,000 BC, I haven't seen it yet, Frank Caliendo, that's a funny one, Ferris Bueller, Mad Dog Glory, Major League, Fletch, uh, Tour Stuff, let's see, hold on here, Wee! see that, uh, Flubber, the Zapped, so I'm trying to go zoom here, now I got one movie that, <clears throat> you know, people were talking about Farrah Fawcett, you know, and some of the stuff that she was in. See, I never watched Char Charlie's Angels. I I pretty much, the only movie that I remember her in, that I can remember, is Man of the House. And I'm not talking the one with the, that came out in 2005 with uh, Tommy Lee Jones. I'm talking the original Man of the House with Jonathan Taylor Thomas and Chevy Chase. And uh, Farrah Fawcett played Jonathan Taylor Thomas's mother in uh, that movie, which I thought was very, very good. Yeah, I got Dirty Dancing, I got Bowfinger, Mr. Destiny. Oh, shit. Got to get down on my knees for this one here. <laughs> okay, where we at? We got some more here. We got Tenacious D, which I also got. The Pick of Destiny from Wet Movie. We got My More from Power Rangers, the movie, of course. Excellent. Lords of Dogtown, Aladdin, DC Cab, Beyond the Law, Fahrenheit 9 11, Mystery Men. Uh, Bat 21, which I have never seen. Uh, and I'll, I'll be honest, there's probably probably a good... Oh, I don't know. There's probably a good two or three hundred movies that I have in my collection that I haven't even seen yet. So why do I buy more? Because eventually I will watch them all. I have a good memory when it comes to that sort of thing, so I just figure, well, what the hell. Uh, Alright, continuing on here, we have more here. We got The Wizard, we got Beethoven... We got Scrooge. We got some disaster uh, pack. A four disaster film collection. We got Back to School with Rodney Dangerfield and the late great, well, late great Rodney Dangerfield and late great Sam Kinison. Spaceballs. Uh, Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back. That's Four Fairlane. Hated Cruisers. Or no, Edward Scissor's Hands. All four Die Hard movies. Uh, Eddie Murphy. Raw. John Candy. The. Three movie collection, Monster Squad, Buddy Holly Story, Naked Gun, Trilogy, Airplane, Mortal Kombat, the first one. Mortal Kombat, the second one's in somewhere over here. Yeah, and I is over there. And then we got All King's Men, Opportunity Knox, Stupids, Cadillac Man, Camp Nowhere, the Michael J. Fox collection. And that's... One row. That's another row. And uh, here, here, I'm going to show you more here in just a sec. Okay, we're back. Now, this is more that I have. And I also have some that I borrowed out to my brother as well. Probably 15 or 20. So I got I got some over here that I had to, you know, I ran out of room. So I had to put some more over here. And trust me, I only have one copy of each movie. Some people have always asked me, it's like, they ask... Do you have more than one copy of the movie? Have you ever... Has that ever happened to you before? It's like, nope. Never has. I, I, I have a pretty good memory of what I buy. Has that ever happened to you guys? When you guys uh, think that you bought a movie and then you actually bought a movie that you already had and because you, you forgot you bought it? Yeah, that's never happened to me yet. I'm surprised. Let's see. So, got House Guess, Pushing Tin, Bingo, The Rizzo Bingo, Mr. Danny, Stripes, Gone Fishing, Forrest Gump, one of the greatest summer type of movies, I think. Summer Rental. Excellent stuff. Excellent. Very excellent, eh? I'd say. John Candy. John Candy could never make a bad film no matter what. John Candy could make a film of him taking a huge dump, and it'd be a, a, a classic, no matter what. You know, because he'd add some humor or whatever to it, you know? That's just the way John Candy was. Charles Bilko, Beethoven Second. I have the first one. Well, see, and, and, and a lot of people are probably wondering, well, why did you get the other Beethoven's? 
those ones suck, you know. I'm not saying I don't have a movie that sucks in the collection, but, you know, it's just that, you know, you should stop with part two, or if you're going to make more Beethoven's, have the original cast. Don't don't have somebody different and make it a, a think that it's good. Just like with the Air Bud movies. Air Bud movies, the first two were great, and then they just... The how many movies they got now? Seven of them or something? Let's see. And then Jumanji, Welcome to Mooseport... Uh, Clue, Good Burger, First Pirates of the Caribbean, Harold and Kumar, the second one, Great Multiplicity, the great movie with Michael Keaton, Adventures in Babysitting, and I got a few more in here, but I'm not going to dig to them, I just want to show you that there's more in here that are just like one row deep, two rows deep, or one row deep, and the same thing over here, the same thing over here with this, I have two rows deep, and I have, these are some of the ones that I just got here a while back. Well, these I've had for a while. Better Off Dead, uh, Lone Weapon, and Senior Trip 2-Pack, Great Outdoors, My Super Ex-Girlfriend, Ten Places. Now, these ones are all the new ones I have, and the last ten of them are ones I haven't even opened yet that I just got. Uh, I got the Burbs, Money Pit. Shanghai Noon, Shanghai Night, some of these you've seen already in the DVD updates. Christmas Time in South Park, and uh, Radio Flyer, Coach Carter. Most of these you've seen in the D DVD updates I recently did. Shanks the Clown, this is one I just got here yesterday from eBay. Uh, with, uh, what was it, Bobcat Goldwaith. Yeah. Because uh, I was looking for a movie, I was going to look. I was gonna get that one crazy summer movie, but I, I, I never seen uh, this one before. Heard about it, but I've never seen it, so figure why not? And then, yeah, some of these I haven't even opened yet. So, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 movies I haven't even opened yet. And that's not all, folks. We still got two more drawers full. So, we'll be right back. All right, for the last part here, uh, this is what we're doing here. We got I'm going to show you the last part of the DVDs I have. And like I said, I got some that I borrowed out to my brother and sister, too. And I, after tallying up, I got probably over 800 movies now. Which, yeah, I mean, it's it's, it's pretty crazy. But, you know, like I said, I don't, I don't smoke, I don't drink. So, what am I supposed to do, you know? So, anyway, here we go. And I got a bunch of stuff that's way in the back here that I can't get at if I, unless I open these. But you can kind of see here a little bit that I have a few... That's a couple rows deep already. Let's see, I got like the Animal House, I got Pot Pie, Undercover Brother, All Walk for Christmas, Flesh Lives. Got the Jurassic Park uh, set, uh, Tiny Tunes. That's got a lot. Uh, Beautiful, or Beavis and Butthead, and Look Who's Talking, Look Who's Talking. I got all the Look Who's Talking stuff. Let's see, got a lot of different. That are full stuff. If there's anything that you recognize, just let me let me know. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of that film. If you see anything that I haven't mentioned that you recognize, and I got you know, more here, here, only living color, little monsters, and the last row finally is this one. We got some movies here, and, and there, these are. As deep as they go here. Mr. Deeds, all the Rub Rat movies, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, oh, just everything. Walk Across Egypt, that was a movie, independent movie with uh, Jonathan Taylor Thomas from 99. And just a whole lot of stuff. Got the uh, Two and a Half Men, Season 1, 2, and 3. Eventually, I will get the Season 4 and 5. That's a good show. Very good show. I had to watch the first season, and I was like, man, this is funny. This is. This is funny co comedy of a of a current car or a current show that has a lot of old time humor in it. You know, just I like it anyway. And I got Bernie Mac show, boyfriend school, Roxanne, all the honey I shrunk the kids stuff, a couple seasons of Simpsons, uh, more Rugrats stuff, Real Buddy Holly story, Tron. Wayne's World 1 and 2, Working Trash, I don't know if you guys ever remember this movie, American Summer, got from eBay, very good stuff, as well as this one here, 
Working Trash, Old Boy from 1990, with Ben Stiller and George Carlin. And yeah, I think that's about it. I think that completes my collection. But don't despair, we're going to show you something else real quick here uh, while we're still making a video. So let's do that.